Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be reviewing the Isidore Signature Winter Bib Shorts Echelon Long Sleeve Jersey and the Echelon Gillette. Whether you're riding the latest carbon fiber bicycle or a garage sale special, when you're riding in colder temperatures, you're not going to perform as well without the proper cycling kit. Having the right combination of warmth and breathability is essential, which brings us to the topic of today's Isidore Cycling Kit. This is a cold weather kit that's designed to combine breathability, warmth, and high performance all into one. We're going to be looking at three items specifically. The signature winter bib shorts. We have their Echelon Gillette, which is a nice packable lightweight Gillette. And then the Echelon Long Sleeve Jersey. So we'll go ahead and we'll start with the bib shorts first. So these are a brand new item in their 2022 lineup. Retail price on this is $250. It combines a lot of high performance elements and water resistance all into one bib shorts. It's designed to really fill the gap between traditional winter bib tights and summer bib shorts. You have highly reflective material here, DWR treatment all the way around for water repellent and a very comfortable elastic but form fitting uh, overall fit. For the camos, it's a 4D technology, so it's a multi-layer seamless camos that's designed to have all day comfort, whether you're doing low intensity or high intensity. So you can see nice seamless design that wraps all the way around and to the front. As with all of Isidore's products, these are also very low key as well. So you can see branding is usually just limited to one or two places and with a lot of nice reflective detailing on here to keep you visible. Now let's take a look at the Echelon Long Sleeve Jersey. Yeah, for this in quite a few colors, we have this nice Zinfidel red finish. Retail price on this is $225. It's a versatile long sleeve jersey that's designed to have high performance, comfort, and a comfortable race-like fit. You can see very minimalist design that matches a lot of the Echelon products. There's actually no branding on here, which is really uh, very unique. Typically you have at least something on here. And it combines two different Lycra materials for really great breathability and again, comfort and fit. You also have a DWR treatment on the exterior to repel some of the water, as well as a brushed interior for really soft, comfortable feel. Now let's take a look at the Gillette. So retail price on this is $145. This is a featherweight Gillette that's designed to easily pack away in your jersey pocket. So especially if you're riding in kind of unpredictable weather, it's something you can pull out for a little extra warmth and wind resistance. So the front panel is a multi-layer Swiss fabric that's designed to be wind resistant. Again, this is a nice packable design that you can easily put in a jersey pocket and provides a lot of the same features of the et other Echelon products, which means it's high performance with very minimalist aesthetics. So no branding on here again, which is really impressive. It's a very understated design and simple construction. Now let's take a look at the fit and finish of the signature winter bib shorts. Now winter bib shorts does seem a bit counterintuitive, but this is really designed to fill the gap between summer bib shorts and then winter bib tights. So this provides a good balance between warmth and comfort and provides more protection against the elements. So this is great if you're doing high intensity workouts in winter or just riding in the shoulder season or cold mornings where you want a little bit of warmth but want to be able to take off your leg warmers as the temperature rises. You can see it combines a lot of their minimalist and high performance design elements. So very subtle branding. You just have these reflective Isidore and large reflective panels along the legs and even the top. So you can see really nice design. It's great to see, especially with black bib shorts. Typically they're just all black and they're pretty much invisible. But here you have these large panels, even on the back where it might be kind of obscured with your jersey. But if you're on the drops, a lot of this could be visible. And that's what I really like about bib shorts as well. You never have to worry about your jersey moving up or uncomfortable uh, hem lines around your waist. So very comfortable, goes all the way up. And then even if you have a bathroom break, uh, easy to do as these are nice and flexible in the front. Has a standard suspender style strap. So you can see two straps on the front, nice and wide, and then very elastic again and breathable. So it keeps you comfortable and you can see almost see-through here. 
with this uh, fabric. On the back, you have this nice large panel. Again, very breathable. Uh, these can typically get very warm, especially as they're touching your skin, but again, very soft here. You have these large reflective panels, which is really impressive to see as well. Typically, a lot of black bib shorts just forget about reflectivity. But here you have these large panels. And you can also see this is actually reinforced with some water uh, resistant membrane. So you won't get the spray seeping through. And they've kind of strategically placed those panels uh, to keep you dry where you need it and then flexible where you don't. So you can see the side has this more elastic material while the front pockets or these front edges are a little bit stiffer and more reinforced. Along the leg hems, you have the standard silicone edging. And you can see it's almost honeycomb pattern. Prevents it from rising, which can be really annoying while you're riding. And nice brush material on the inside. It's all fully finished. So you can see all the seams are nice and tight and nice and comfortable as this goes right up against your skin. The important part of any bib shorts is obviously the camos. And here they don't have any fancy names for it. It's called a 4D multi-layer construction. So you can see it's nice and comfortable here with multiple layers on this nice pattern. It's a seamless design as well. So you can see the front nose extends quite a bit further. And then the nice zipper uh, seams along the edge uh, to keep everything in place. Now let's go over the fit and finish of the long sleeve Echelon jersey. As a part of the Echelon product line, it's really optimized for understated looks and high performance. And with a long sleeve jersey, it's designed for aerodynamics as well. So nice race fit. So very form fitting with a lot of lycra used to be very elastic. So you can see there's basically two materials here. No branding on here, which is kind of a surprise. So on the front, it's all just one solid color. You have the main material here, which is a little bit more wind resistant and still has quite a bit of elasticity. Well, you have the more breathable second Italian lycra on the side. And you can see that pattern on there. So more flexible. And that goes all along your armpit, along the corners and back. So really nice breathability and that's the most important thing with any cold weather jersey. You want to make sure you're warm, but at the same time you can still uh, regulate your temperature. If you were to wear something like a plastic bag, you'd be warm, but you would be sweating a storm within a few minutes. So with this, you get that nice combination. A lot of premium details here, as you would expect. And you have the reflective uh, hems here on the arms. So really nice detail. It provides a little contrast. Same reflectivity on the back as well. And we love to see that, especially when you ride at night or low visibility. You wanna make sure you're visible on the road regardless of what color your kit is in. Full length front zipper. And you can see you actually have zipper garages on the top and bottom, which are these little loops. So that prevents any discomfort. And then this little winter or this cold weather protection on the back. So that prevents wind from going through the zipper. So nice protection and again, nice and comfortable. The interior is this nice brushed material as well. So very soft to the touch. So nice and comfortable. And then you have the mid-layer, uh, mid-level collar. So it keeps you warm when you need it. Zipper itself is pretty fancy too with this little metal handle. And you can see zipper garage on the bottom as well. And then the inside fully finished. You can see the two material construction. So they're just wrapped in here with seams for the more, again, more elasticity and breathability. You have a little label on the inside, which tells you all the details. And it's actually made in Slovakia, which is kind of interesting. You don't see that a lot with the lower end products. So nice to see more EU made products. You have the silicone backing here and that prevents it from rising. So nice uh, non-slip material. We go to the back. Again, very simple design. Uh, multi-panel again so you have the main panel on the back and then these armpit uh, side panels that provide better uh, closer fit with elasticity three pockets and they're fairly small compared to other jerseys they seem a little bit more narrow visually uh, you have one main on the middle and then two on the sides they're fairly deep though so you can see pretty good size to them and then this right pocket actually has another detail and has a little inner pocket so this is great for credit cards, keys, smaller stuff. You don't have the zippered version, but you just have this inner pocket instead, which is nice to have. 
The other little detail here is if you have headphones, they actually added a hook here on the uh, left side of the in interior and you can run your headphones through there, which is a nice uh, premium touch. Now let's take a look at the fit and finish of the Echelon Gillette. Whether you call this a Gillette or a vest as we do here in America, they're very convenient little apparel item for cycling. It's great if you have mixed weather, whether you're doing a warm climb and then a cold descent, you can pop this on and provide some wind resistance and then pack it away when you don't need it. You can see this is part of the Echelon product line and that means very subtle understated design with high performance. So there's literally no branding on here, which again, very weird to see. Uh, simple construction with a lot of this elastic material on the edges. So that provides a very comfortable form fitting fit that will actually stretch around you. So you don't have to be a skinny European to use these. On the back, you have that same very stretchable material. All, the entire bottom essentially is that with the wind resistant material on the front. So that really ensures it stays really lightweight, but keeps you warm. On the back, you have this little extension that go, wraps around. And again, this multi-panel design that's designed to really be form fitting and flexible. Full length front zipper. And with the little splash of color here with the zipper pull. So you can see really simple double zippers. So you can actually adjust your temperature very easily. You have that wind resistant flap on the back, which is something you see with a lot of uh, kind of vests or jackets. So that prevents it from going wind going through the zipper itself. And then the little zipper garages on the top and bottom. You have two different color zippers as well, which is kind of cool to see. So easy to differentiate which is which. And pretty much a no logo on here, just little circles. And this lets you again, just adjust your temperature as you're riding. As with a lot of the Isidore products, they're very keen on reflectivity. So you can see a reflective hem that goes all the way around. And something that's really essential and a lot of companies forget to do, they make everything all black and which makes you essentially invisible at night. So with this, you have these nice reflective details, a little Isidore logo. So very subtle and provides again some reflectivity and along the back hem as well. There's kind of an interesting pocket here. You can see it's actually see-through, uh, almost see-through here. And then you have this somewhat kind of hidden pocket. So you could put small items in here, but typically you put more of your uh, items in your jersey. And again, EU made, which is great to see, being a Slovakian company, uh, they do a lot of sustainable material sourcing. So everything's kind of close to Slovakia and really uh, sustainable methods as well. Now let's take a look at the kit on the road. Here we have it paired with our DMT KR0 shoes in that bright red and a gray cask Brotone icon. So it's a great looking combination, very sleek. You don't have a ton of branding on here. Really the only branding is that Isidore on the winter bib shorts and a lot of that reflective elements on here that we're really happy to see. So even though you have a black on black, you can see a big reflective panel on the bib shorts and around the edging. Here we have it paired with some leg warmers and even a base layer underneath the jersey as it's a little bit colder day, but you can easily adjust this and wear that on slightly warmer days without the base layer or leg warmers. The Echelon kit is very sleek. You can see solid color with that race fit, so it really contours around you. And that Gillette is a very useful piece, so you have the nice windproof membrane on the front, breathable panel on the back so you don't overheat. And then if you're doing a descent, you can put it on. And when you're done with it, you just wrap it up, stuff it in a pocket. The jersey, again, very form fitting. And even though it looks like it's skin tight, it's very comfortable thanks to the elastic panels on the edges. So it contours around you without being too restrictive. Again, the styling on this is very sleek, so minimal branding. You just have a logo on the bottom corner and those large three pockets. Now let's go over the scored card for the Isidore Cycling Kit. We're going to grade on three different categories, design, sizing, and comfort. Across the board, all three items get an A. They're all really well designed. The winter bib shorts are form fitting and they have those special membranes and reflective elements that keep you safe and comfortable. The camos is also quite comfortable. So even on short or multi-hour rides, you won't have any discomfort on the saddle. The Echelon Jersey, although it looks like it's skin tight, it's surprisingly comfortable. It has the elastic panels. So the combination of that form fit, that race style fit, and that minimalist branding is a really good look. So something you can easily layer up for colder days or use it as is on a slightly warmer day. The Gillette is also a very useful piece. 
It's very compact, so you can just stuff it into your pocket when you don't need it. And it has the dual zippers and with that minimal styling, again, it's super light and looks great with whatever kit you combine it with. Thanks for watching this review. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You can see more content from us on our website at thesweetcyclist.com as well as follow us on Instagram at thesweetcyclist. This is The Sweet Cyclist reminding you to enjoy the ride.